What we've done this this fair trade fortnight has been probably advanced more than any other. Um, you can see that the uh, there's a picture a image on the left, which is a cake, and the cake was baked in um, recognition of four years of a High Wycombe Grecia Fair Trade Town Celebration Partnership. So we've linked the towns together, the mayors together, two schools together, Highcrest Academy and the um, Liceo Experimental Bilingue de Grecia in, in Grecia. We also have linked um, two companies together, Coop Victoria, which is a massive, which is the largest fair trade cooperative in um, Costa Rica, something like 3,000 farmers, workers, sugar, coffee, and now Del Coco as well. And soon to be hemp, they're growing hemp for, for clothing. Um, so this was this was produced by the um, by the mayors. And as you can see on the image on the right, we were launching not just a fair trade plaque, which cemented the Wickham Fair Trade Town uh, Mayors uh, partnership, but you can see there that um, the, the, they're advertising a coffee, which we had um, imported into the raw beans imported into this country to us. And you see there the guy on the on the left of the mayor, that's Matt Hussein. Uh, that's um, sorry, that's um, uh, Arif Hussein. Um, the guy on the left is Wayne Katsia. He's the owner of a micro roastery, and they experimented with some of these beans. I um, Wickham Fair Trade had um, roughly 100 kilos of coffee raw green beans flown over from Costa Rica, and um, Roast Lab roasted them in different different batches, different tastes, and we got a, an ideal blend. And this is single origin coffee. And that is why Ambassador Ortiz, who is on the right from the UK Embassy of Costa Rica and a major supporter of ours, he was there to launch the coffee. And in fact, that even before you see the, the mayor holding the coffee bag, a, a coffee bag was sold to a coffee and aficionado online uh, in Reading. So, um, this is going to be a it's going to be uh, made available through um, Roast Labs online um, website. It's going to be available in four or five outlets around in and around High Wycombe. And we're going to advertise it and we're going to sell it at fair trade stalls, um, a big pan mill uh, event coming up in May. And we're going to sell it informally as well. Friends, family, word of mouth, etc. The coffee has scored a huge, um, has got a huge um, quality um, and cupping score, and we think it's, it'll sell itself. So that was a major, major coup, and the, the plaque was presented to the mayor, who in turn presented it to the school for their amazing work that they've done. So we're, we're all together, and we've, we've made this link, we've deepened it and strengthened it throughout those four years. Yeah, that's that's so fascinating to hear about it, and um, yeah, I'm sure it was an awful lot of work, but yeah, the outcome is just fantastic. All aspects of that from the it was a, it was it was personally rewarding, but incredible. Mm -hmm. Sometimes it felt like nailing spaghetti to the wall, but yeah, um, uh, it was it was it, it was getting all these organisations together, but they all responded, and yeah, um, when you've got people who listen to you and share your your views. And provide provide some excellent um, other ideas as well. It's um, we're all singing from the same hymn sheet, really. <laughs>